You are by now, no doubt, familiar with the Immortal Games, yes? No? <sighs> hmm, clearly you are falling behind in your reading for the term. No matter, I have a practical solution at hand. The Immortal Games are an open challenge hosted by the denizens of Aquila, one of my favorite empires to study. Unlike other provincial tournaments, this is more of a free-form approach. They are open to any students of magic, not just wizards. The games will push you to your limits but are an excellent test of your determination, wit, and fortitude. Impress the immortals of Aquila, and who knows what secrets you might glean. Go and speak to the legionnaire Romulus on Cyclops Lane. He will tell you how to begin the competition. Many greetings, wizard. If you are sound, then all is well. Professor Drake sent you? He has much favor with my people. Ah, he told you to ask about the immortal games? The immortals of Mount Olympus, the greatest heroes and champions of Aquila, host this Herculean competition. But I've been away so long, I've forgotten the way home. Seek Harold Argleston in the library. He'll know how to get you there. I hope you aren't here to research with Professor Palmer. She is very kind, but I am not for the smoldering books. You are working on a study for Professor Drake. Most admirable. I applaud your courage. What do you need to know? How to reach Aquila? I simply use the cherry to be. That's the monument in the park on Cyclops Lane. It's been there forever. You must have passed it at least a hundred times. I'm surprised you've never asked about it. I believe we have a scroll that explains how to activate it. Search the upper shelves under CH. told you to use the Chariot of Athon? Of course! It will take you to the Garden of the Hesperides, and from there you may enter the Immortal Games. Anyone from the Spiral may compete to prove themselves in this magical challenge. Those who are victorious win honor and praise and glory. Those who fall short, well, they are welcome to try again. Once they have healed any bruises and broken bones, of course. <laughs> Use the scroll of Aethon to activate the chariot and travel to Aquila. Once you reach the Garden of the Hesperides, speak to the satyr Silenus. Silenus tends the garden and is a philosopher and poet. He will explain the immortal games.
Hail, wizard. How will the world speak your name? You have come to put your name forward in the immortal games? And we are honored whenever a participant takes up the call. The immortals, the great winged lords and ladies of Aquila, enjoy crafting challenges and seeing who can overcome them. There are three parts of the immortal games in total, each with its own grave risk and thrilling rewards. The first competition takes you to the heart of Olympus. The immortals themselves speak to my oldest daughter, the nymph Aegle. She will tell you more, then return to me. It is a pleasure to meet you. I welcome you to our wondrous home of Aquila. Mount Olympus is the home of the immortals. They have lived there for as long as memory and have mastered the great forces. The immortals created these games for their own amusement, but also to reward the most skilled magicians in the spiral. In Olympus, the shining city upon the mountain you will face battles of wits, magical duels, and the lightning itself. You have a kind face, so I hope you do well. 